the EP2 grease or an equivalent. In your own M book, we give you a variety of names and their numbers. You can cross reference to the brand that you use. Just keep in mind, over greasing the pre uh, bearings is just as bad as not greasing it. On the back of the bearing, there is a grease cup. When you grease the bearings, we want you to purge the grease out the back. These are not purge plugs. The plugs on the bottom of the bearings, if you want to move this Zerk fitting down here because it's more convenient, that's what those plugs are for. They're not purge plugs. Do not take them out and grease them. Grease it out the back. Once you're done greasing it, take the cup apart, clean it, put it back together. It's an all-day event to grease this big press because you have to take those cups off. If you don't take the cups off, next time you grease it, the, the cups are just going to break because the grease is going to harden. The other issue we got uh, that came up, I want to stress on these spray headers. It's very, very important that every couple of hours you come by and rotate these handles fully counterclockwise until it stops and then clockwise again until it stops. You have, you have 30 seconds to do each one. On, on the old presses, uh, they're telling me they've never, they never do this. Clean nozzle leads to a clean, uh, uh, by rotating the brushes, you get a clean nozzle, which leads to a good clean belt, which get, leads to a clean performance. So I, I can't stress it enough. Very, very important that you do this.